Hello everyone, welcome in my channel, ASP.NET Core. Today I'm going to show you how to create a JSON file dynamically. So just uh, give an example, uh, create a JSON file dynamically from an object. Uh, I mean to say that uh, you have a class and uh, just I want to convert a JSON file uh, in ASP.NET Core dynamically. So you can use it here from uh, convert file yeah here we have ID number is 5 and the name is uh, Smith and the city is New York looking like that and just time to uh, click on the create button and you have to see uh, your outputs uh, in the form of the JSON file just under the uh, folder name and you have to uh, check uh, number 2 number one file and number fifth file in the form of the smith like looking like this so uh, these uh, file is created dynamically in ASP.NET Core how to create that file in uh, in that uh, in ASP.NET Core so just uh, first of all uh, in a home controller uh, so first of all add a new uh, class in the view model like employee uh, here we have three fields like ID name and the city and uh, in a controller section uh, first of all get section prepare a get section and generate a view uh, uh, looking like that convert file so here we have three text boxes related to the ID name and uh, the city and the one button control when we click on the button submit button then the post uh, HTTP post will here here uh, first of all convert your uh, model uh, into the JSON format so by using jtoken uh, dot from object employee and convert into the j object uh, j object ha having with the JSON file format so just uh, add that file in the uh, in the directory so you can use web host environment dot uh, web root path so web host environment actually exist in the i web hosting environment so i web hosting environment initialize in the constructor looking like this this is okay and now just uh, go to the uh, ww root folder by using web host environment dot web root path so you have to here and create a JSON uh, folder name that is this and the file name is GUID dot new GUID created and with the JSON uh, uh, extension and the file path is again we can use path dot combine the directory name and the file name there is so the dot JSON file name and save that file with the text so you can use system.io.file.write all text in the file path and where is the file path so you can use there is file path the directory name with the file name and uh, you can uh, use file path as well as append the text in the file that is the obj just uh, uh, transfer from the uh, here from object mp that is there and there is passed to the Loc uh, local variable uh, you can say the pass by value to, to that object and save um, that object value in the file so there is the output so thank you very much for watching this video and keep watching all other videos which is related to json in later videos thank you very much